How's it going, guys? And welcome back to another JHR review. And welcome back to another gotcha video. And of course, I don't just have one. I have two different gotcha bags. And this is kind of from, I wouldn't say it's a retro show, but it's like a 2011, I believe, release. It is Disney's Gravity Falls. And I'm a really big fan of this show. I actually really enjoyed it. Um, as an adult who watches cartoons, it really kind of put me back into like the nostalgic like I want to see what the next episode is kind of thing. It had a really good uh a good writing staff and I think it was really nice and well put together. So let's go ahead and open this up but first let's take a look at the packaging. So this is Dipper which is the main character. We have some other characters on here as well. I can't remember his name. And then we have the main character's cousin. Yeah, I can't remember names. I got a plane flying over. Oh, it's Mabel. How could I forget Mabel? Mabel and Ford Pines, Dipper Pines, and then Seuss. Probably my favorite. I would love to get him. That would be that would be great. And then you can actually kind of clamp these guys together, apparently. We have Wendy. And do we have two different Ford Pines, or that's just the top one? And then, uh, Gronky Stan. Grunkle Stan. I, I can't read. <laughs> but yeah, let's go ahead and open this guy up, and then let's kind of see what we got. Alright, let's pull this off. And it's wrapped inside of this as well to make it even more mysterious. And are you guys ready? We got Ford Pines. Actually not my favorite one that I was kind of hoping to get, but it's actually still pretty cool. He's not my least favorite character, but it would have been cool to get uh, Zeus. So here's a zoom in of the character. Pretty decent amount of detailing. It's kind of interesting that those aren't actual glasses. It's just kind of an extension of his flesh to the front side of the glasses rim. And his eyeballs are just painted on. And it's slightly a lighter color, so it's a little off-putting. But that's okay. Standing on some kind of rock. And then if we zoom out a little bit, we can get a good view of the base. And this is where they're supposed to connect with each other. Interesting. Let's go ahead and open the next one. All right. And let's hope that we get a different one. Let's open it up. Oh, yes. This is exactly the one that I wanted. This is Zeus. I am so happy that I got this one. I was really hoping to. How cool is that? I love it when you get the ones that you want. Let's go ahead and zoom in on that. It says Sup Dog. Pretty cool design. And I like that they're in these little kind of domes because like you can't really take them off and uh, they'll stay good for a really long time. You're not gonna get them all kind of scratched up. Let's see about stacking them though, because they have these little kind of things on here. Let's zoom in. And that's it. Doesn't fall off. Pretty cool stuff. Very neat and uh, great way to collect things, because you can clamp them together on the side too. So you can make a stack of them and then maybe just put them against your wall. So that's actually a really good feature. Kind of keeps the clutter away, but also makes it to where you can have a decent amount of uh, collectibles. A huge shout out to my Patreons. Thank you guys so much for your support. You guys are awesome. What do you guys think? Are you guys a fan of Gravity Falls? Or was it a little bit too far out of your uh, age span? Or are you the age where Gravity Falls was primarily a thing? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.